It was just the most horrendous, horrible act of animal cruelty. This is Jake, a three-year-old hound mix. In February, Jake was walking in his own front yard when he was shot in the neck. Carl and Karen Hausman rushed the dog into surgery. Nine months later, Jake is confined to this mat with no control of his bladder. His rear end cannot move. He has reflexes. You can mess with his feet. Eric Hillard appeared in a Rowan County courtroom Wednesday morning facing felony animal cruelty charges, charged with shooting Jake. Jake's owners want him to pay. No matter what they put upon him as a punishment for this, will not compare to what we will go through and what Jake will go through for the rest of his life. Hundreds of people are following this case through a Facebook group page called Who Shot Jake? Some even sending letters to the DA asking Hillard to be fully prosecuted under Susie's law. This isn't Hillard's first run in with the law. His charges date back to 1992. They include drugs, a larceny, shoplifting, although he's never spent time in prison. Wandering around on private property with a gun with no intention other than to just suit something or someone. And to me, that's extremely scary and very dangerous. The housemen still have this sign in their yard where the shooting happened. It offers a reward for the conviction of Jake's attacker. And they say it will stay there until there is a conviction. Regardless of what happens in the courtroom, the housemen are hopeful their dog will continue to defy the odds. He's happy and we will continue working as hard as we can. To, to have him walk again, even if it is with the wheels. In Rowan County, Carly Stevenson, Time Warner Cable News. That'll make him happy.